on Caveman Keto Recipes, I'm going to show you how to make cauliflower casserole. This is one of my five day meals, meaning it's enough food for two people for five days. Uh, and I've designed this casserole dish so that it can be made in parallel with something else. You'll notice there's things like we're putting chicken in the oven and cooking it. Um, I'm going to show the entire recipe serially, uh, but you can do most of these steps in parallel to speed it up. So let's get started. These days it's all about speed. So now, instead of cutting up and manually cooking the chicken, I bake them in the oven. It actually takes a little bit longer, but it's a lot less work. To go along with my theme of cooking faster, I like to cook the bacon in my mini convection oven while the chicken is in the big oven. Once the bacon's done, you can go ahead and cut it into strips. For the cauliflower in this recipe, you can either start with a head of cauliflower, or I was actually able to find an entire bag of freshly cut cauliflower florets. I'm just gonna cut them down a little bit so that they're a little smaller for the casserole. Now you can take all this cauliflower and put it in the microwave, either on the vegetable setting or on high for three to four minutes. Next, chop up six green onions. Now that our chicken's out of the oven, we can start to cut it into pieces. Again, I find it's much easier to cut after it's been cooked than to cube it and cook it in a pan ahead of time. Add in one head of cauliflower. Add in one pepper one onion, eight ounces of cream cheese, four ounces of heavy cream. Now at this point, I like to mix. Season with salt and pepper. One tablespoon of minced garlic. Mix again. Now add six of the eight ounces of cheddar cheese, six of the eight ounces of Monterey Jack cheese, and the green onions. And the bacon. Now take a 4.8 quart baking dish. Add Pam, throw the ingredients in. Now take the reserved cheese, sprinkle it on the top. Well folks, here's the finished casserole fresh out of the oven. What I like to do now, is I divide it into 10 equal servings. Then I take one of these handy dandy lunch containers. Well, there you have it folks. It's cauliflower casserole. We've split it into 10 different portions, and now you're set for lunch for the week. One of the most popular recipes in the five-day category on cavemanketo.com. So check it out on the website for more detailed instructions and pictures, and nutritional information, and also subscribe to the blog and the YouTube channel. Thanks.